Recently I reacted to Finnish police in a motorcycle police chase. It was an excellent video, really showed the skill of the Finnish police on their motorcycle, as well as being a great tour of what I've now learned, an area around Helsinki. Looked like a beautiful place and on that video someone asked me if I can watch this one. It's called Epic Moped Police Chase Getaway Pepper Spray on the Face. And this is in Finland also, I believe. Uh, so again, tell me where this is. Tell me what you think about it. And yeah, let's watch another police chase. And what I wanted to say is, when I was going to watch this, there was a video recommended at the side, and it was about mopeds in Finland. Or is there some sort of moped culture in Finland? Are they popular there? I know that in Europe, in Italy, there's a lot of mopeds. Here in Asia, especially Malaysia, Thailand, Vietnam, it's a huge amount, but I never really knew there was mopeds or that sort of culture in Finland. Uh, tell me more about that. So I think this is actually on the, per, or this is from the perspective of the actual moped rider themselves, not the police, which is something I've never seen before actually, a different perspective, this should be quite interesting, should be seeing him being chased. Is that a police there, wow, is that a van? So close, they caught him, caught up to him so quickly. Oh, this is very, very precarious road. Well, he we handled that beautifully there, some great driving. Maybe this area looks more rural than the last video. I can't imagine being chased by the police like this and hearing the siren. This is definitely an interesting perspective compared to the last one when we were in the view of the police. Being chased by the police in this. Okay, so that was the moment. Let's see that again, man. That was quite good aim. Well, man, he really sprayed so much out there. Hanging out the window. Good driving by the police not to knock him off the bike. Very close and perfect aim actually thinking about it. This guy's wearing a helmet so I guess there's a visor so it shouldn't have too much effect. I guess it would just be a bit dirty and harder to see but I've never seen a police officer pepper spray someone driving by them before. Trying to block off his road, block off his way as well. Oh. So close to that big bollard thing there. That's the thing about driving in Finland, there's so much snow, especially on a motorbike, it must be so dangerous and so risky, especially a road like this. Look at that. I would have thought it would be slicking all over the place. Good escape. But if that's pepper spray, does the smell of it not cause a lot of uh, a lot of problems for the person who inhales it? Thought it would have been hard to actually even drive or concentrate after that. This guy's just driven like a pro. 
I wonder why he was being chased in the first place. Oh. Where is he going? Is that some sort of lay? Or just a heavy snow area? Okay, is he hiding the bike? Well, wow, very clever. That's actually a very good idea. Police... Police found the moped and knew who the driver was, so I guess that was all in vain. He actually never... He still got caught, that's a shame. It was like very good driving, but I guess if they got the number plate, they can find the location of the driver and just go to back to his address and he would have eventually f picked up the bike. Uh, but he did good driving there, that was very interesting. I've never seen a motor cyclist be pepper sprayed or I've never seen police shoot pepper spray from a van, a moving vehicle. So good policing. They managed to slow the guy down and make him drop the bike. Not but I guess in the end they still caught him. So tell me what you think about that. Have you ever seen that sort of thing happen before? Are police chases common in Finland? I never knew. But tell me what you think about this one. Thanks.